show a little variation for you with the front alternate raise. Again, understanding innervation training means getting away from uh, strength as a very essential understanding. It's all about ranges and planes of motion and how muscles function within them. So this is a leaning front alternate cable raise. We use the free motion machine. You can use tubing. Kevin's going to get in. He's going to walk that out. And we remember muscle stretch with resistance receive the most overload. So he's already in that pre-stretch position, which is so hard to get with dumbbells. And he's going to alternate them up. He's going to reach as far in front of him as he can. This way, not only is he getting the anterior delt, he's getting all through the back chain and the lower trapezius, and he's not getting that base of support you would get if you were standing up to do front alternate raises. So it's a huge payoff, and with the cables, we have constant tension. There's no gravity release because the tension's always on the muscle. And he gets, again, he reaches out as far as he can. Great, great payoff all through the delts from the anterior, medial, and posterior chain. And that's the leaning front alternate cable or tubing extension. And that's how we think differently in terms of innervation training versus just the basic traditional stuff.